بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم اللهم صل على محمد وآل محمد so in al bayt al haram we know that this is al kaaba al musharrafa and you also have maqam ibrahim which is on that uh, on this side over here it's maqam maqam ibrahim and then you have hijr ismail this is hijr ismail Hijr Ismail, one of the things that uh, we know from a fiqhi perspective is that you're supposed to be walking, when you're doing a tawaf, you walk outside of Hijr Ismail. But what is Hijr Ismail? Hijr Ismail was, according to what our historians say, it's the uh, burial place of Ismail alayhi salam and also his mother uh, Hajar salamullah alayha. It's also said that there are prophets buried here and it's also said that this was where uh, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi would do his ibadah and recite the Holy Quran. Um, it's, it is indeed a place where it is recommended to uh, walk into uh, after you've done your tawaf or before you've done your tawaf and uh, pray to rak'ahs especially under that gutter that is called mi- Mizanul Rahma or Mirzabul Rahma it's said that if you were to pray underneath it Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will forgive you uh, for your sins uh, like as if you were born, uh, born again. Um, it's also called Al Hatim. This area is also called Al Hatim, um, and of course, as you can see, it's very, very uh, congested inside. Uh, I just wanted to show you uh, how it looks like. As you can see, it's a semicircle. Um, among the f- things that you need to remember when you're doing your tawaf is you're not supposed to be touching the Kaaba. You're also not supposed to be uh, going touching the. Um, well, you don't. So, some fuqaha don't allow it, but just stay away from uh, touching uh, Hijr Ismail. Um, I might make a clip on just some of the general recommendations that should be observed when you're doing the tawaf, but I think most importantly is that you find a time where you won't be uh, interrupted by any um, salah. Uh, And remember that they they usually start um, preparing for salah around about 45 minutes before salah time for the five daily prayers um, so maybe after Fajr what is, would be one good time or maybe after Isha would be another good time but anyway I might make one uh, clip on uh, recommendations for Tawaf but as far as Ziyara is concerned for my Ziyara vlog I wanted to add uh, Hijr Ismail as one of the Um, important places for a person uh, to visit and um, do dua under inshallah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will grant us the tawfiq of visiting Baytullah and please if you do come here uh, remember me in your dua especially under um, Mizan Mirzab Al uh, Rahma. Uh, it's Rajab now, so Ziyara Rajabia, because of Ziyara Rajabia, it's very crowded. And um, inshallah. Walhamdulillahi rabbil alameen, wa salatu salam ala Muhammad wa alihi ta'ala.